we would like to welcome and thank you all for coming out to our first annual Coach Carfagno Memorial Alumni Game. Hosted by the Narstown Area High School Girls Soccer Team. We are all here tonight to honor a beloved mentor, friend, father, and husband, Mr. Carmen Carfagno. The girls' soccer program owes a lot to him. He helped found the program as head coach in 2005 and was pulled out of his first retirement to come back as assistant coach in the fall of 2012. Some players remember him as their favorite coach in their career or their inspiration to become teachers themselves. His positivity and motivation kept them fighting no matter what the score. He taught soccer. He taught determination. He taught discipline to all the goofballs. And he taught Coach Notze many idioms. Let us all remember and honor his beautiful soul with a moment of silence. And now to introduce the players for tonight's match. Class of 2008, Bridget Gibson. Class of 2008, Lindsay Kay. Class of 2008, Nicole Kelly. Class of 2009, Tess Kilostri. Class of 2010, Alyssa McMillan. Class of 2012, Norma Lopez. Class of 2014, Ada Rodriguez. Class of 2015, Allison Henning. Class of 2015, Hannah Kira. Class of 2015, Brianna Schools. Class of 2016, Darian Enright. Class of 2017, Rosemary De La Luz. Class of 2017, Maria Sanchez. Class of 2018, Mitzi Gutierrez. Class of 2018, Leslie Munoz. Class of 2018, Anna Lopez. Class of 2018, Adriana Jimenez. Class of 2018, Sandra Irene. Class of 2019, Arian Zaqueda. Class of 2019, 
Jasmine Hernandez. And now, uh, tonight's match will be officiated by NAHS head coach, Lisa Noche. Now, if you would all stand for the playing of our national anthem. Welcome to NAHS girls soccer coach in honor of the Coach Barra of the Mean Game. I'm here with
from the white team. Pass to... The keeper wants to get the ball away from the goal. <laughs> it gets saved by the goalie on the white team. Kicked off to Sadi. Pass to... Red. White team's traveling. Pass to Sadi again. One. Got the ball, so she is tossing it back to the center of the field, getting it to Claudia to pick the ball. Mm. There's no defense up there to stop her right now. We got one. Nerm the walk. There's a corner kick from the pink team, saved by the goalie. The pink team is making several attempts to get up the up to get up to field, but the white team has defense, a strong defense, pushing them that's stopping them and pushing them back from scoring. Ball is out on the white team, throwing in from pink. Shoot, but the goalie stops it and saves it. The ball is passed to Mitzi Gutierrez, a student from 2019, I mean 2018. Ball is out. thrown in for white. Thrown in from white from...
as White makes its way down the field, the Pink's defense has to step up. Rachel and Sadie are both running towards the ball right now. As Rachel keeps holding on to the ball, ball is passed on to Mitzi Gutierrez, interfered yeah. by the pink and out. Corner kick from White from Mitzi Gutierrez. Pink steals the ball and drives up the field, only to get stopped by White's defense. As Sadie has the ball passed to Jasmine. Stolen from White. And out. out. Yeah. White throw in. Sadie has the ball going around. Past. Oh. Off the field. <laughs> Claudia has the ball, kicking it to another teammate on the field. So we'll be driving up towards the goal, but Pink's defense stops it and pushes the ball out of bounds. There are 20 minutes on the clock, saved, a goal saved by Hannah on the white team. I'm sorry, the pink team. Pink drives up towards the white goal and gets and the ball by, by Claudia. That was a close one. Mm -hmm. Sadi now has the ball driving down the up the field. Yep. As Claudia intercepts. On the, from the white team, pass to Jasmine, interfered by Emmy, Emily. Out of bounds, throw in for Pink. Sandra now has the ball. Oh, pass it on to another teammate from the white. Oh. 
Defense on pick. Cleared the ball from the goal and drives up the field. It's Allison. Jasmine now has the ball. She is oh, um, passing up for Saudi to shoot. Oh, with his ball. <laughs> Ball is now being chased by Sandri. Oh, now the pink team is interfering. Mitzi tried kicking it away. It is back to pink up the field, getting ready to shoot. For Sadi to kick in the ball, but White's defense stops. on white throwing for pink I think threw it in and got intercepted by Mitzi pass to Sadi or Sandro who graduated in 2018 and now Sadi has the ball and is Rosemary De La Cruz has the ball and it's going up. Both have really good goals, so it's going to be very good. Yes, that is true. Some of the younger players were worried that since they had more experience, it would be harder to play with them, but they also are older and might not have played for a while, so it's very interesting. Stop by the goalie. Stopped by Bridget on the white team. Thanks to Coach for showing these amazing girls all these amazing soccer skills. This game has become very competitive. Sadi now has the ball from the pink team. Is passed it on to Emily. Pass to Sadi <laughs> on the pink team. Pass back to That's a close touch Sandra. Yeah. Almost kicked out by White, but they successfully kept it in, and now she's going up to shoot. Oh. They almost scored. Just the communication wasn't there, so. Yeah. That's the main problem. Communication is a big thing. <laughs> it is. Because if people aren't talking on the field, then no one knows where to go or who to pass to. Or if someone else is going to grab the ball. Oh!
the game has continued with 13 minutes on the clock. Score still 0-0. Zero zero. Unfortunately, a player on white got injured. It was being kicked. By oh, and pink goal. Goal. One goal to the pink team. The score is now Eagles 1 and guess. I was it, Eagles 0, guest 1. I'm sorry. Ball was saved by goalie on the white team. There's 11 minutes left on the clock. Yes. Mitty is signaling she is open running up the field. Mitty has now has the ball. Oh, interfered by Payne for defense. Kick back to Sadi. Pink team. Yes. The ball unfortunately was not solid. <laughs> But yes. Claudio Morales now has the ball. Has to jazz. Oh, enter pink got the ball now. They almost called off sides. Yeah. They realized it before they got called off sides. White drives down the field. Pass to Matikatira. Pass back with miscommunication again. And then pink has the ball. Yes. They call the handball, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. On white. Yeah. From Rosemary from the white team, handball. Yeah. White tries to drop the ball back, but Pink steals it and drives up the field in an attempt to score again. Goalie saved it and punted it back, and now they're competing for the ball. Tears now has a ball. Yeah, there's a collision between <laughs> Jasmine and Emily. That's fine. 
we're fine. <laughs> <laughs> Forgot to add that. <laughs> Punts it and Claudia stops it. The ball is passed by back in by the pink team. He tries to scoot, shoot, but misses. Post. Yes, did hit the post. So Mackenzie, are you excited by um, this year's, this upcoming school year? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not. I don't know. I kind of want to get back into it, but not really. Got. It's back to the pink team, driving down the field, and oh, she was so close. Mm -hmm. I know there's a lot of freshmen coming into the high school and are excited to play for North Sun Area High School. Yeah, I'm excited, but I'm also kind of sad because Carl Fragman was my first coach. And it's different because he didn't coach the same way as Miss Noche, and they have very different styles of coaching. But this year we have a lot more people and a lot stronger of a team, so that's better, and I'm excited. See how that plays out. Mm -hmm. Going on the white team is now, I guess. <laughs> oh, actually, Jasmine is going to. Mitzi now has the ball. Oh, no, she lost control of the ball. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the ball got kicked out and it's going to be throw it's it in. To commentate because it's back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, since they're both very competitive. Yeah, both it's teams. Well, it's a lot of action. Yeah. One player has the ball, one has it, one has it, and then she does it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited for this school year. Just a <laughs> lot. <laughs> Just a lot of new people coming yeah. in. There's a lot of new things. Laptops, yeah, laptops, book, bags. book bags, yeah. <laughs> Rosemary now has the ball and is Oh, 
Rosemary has the ball once again, is passing it to Jasmine. Now the pink team has a team going around white for defense. <laughs> and saved by the white goalie. Oh. <laughs> Sadie now has the ball from the pink team and is driving up to the white goalies. White team's goalie. Sadie has the ball again. It is being come in by Claudia, but Claudia misses. Rosemary now has the ball, pass. Saved by the goalie from the white the team. making several attempts to clear the ball from their side of the field, but pink's offense is too strong. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Just gotta agree. <laughs> oh, ahead once by Sadi. Got in by. Oh, Nerma. White team is not making it down with the field. Oh, stopped. Passed by. Sadi now has the ball. Sandra. The assistant coach. So it's fun to watch her play. Because she was the assistant coach last year with Carfagno. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we have a minute and 20 seconds on the clock. First half, yes, first time is almost over with uh, white team zero and pink team two. But the goalie stops the ball on time. Yep, so one minute left on the clock. Pink team, oh, pass to Rosemary is in. That's the ball. Well, it's passed to the goalie for a ball. Claudia now has the ball with 30 seconds on the time. Mitzi Gutierrez passing to, oh, intercepted by Emily from the pink team. Back to Mitzi, sorry from the pink team now. <laughs> you're right, it's oh, kind of, 15 seconds left on the yes. You're right, it is hard to commentate because the ball just goes back and forth. <laughs> Like one name after another. That's how you know it's gonna be a good game. Though. Yes. Ball is out. Um, the white team. So. And the first half's over. Yes. With mm -hmm. Half time. Half time is ten minutes. So we can go. And at the end of the first half, it's pink two white. Zero. Uh, if you want some snacks from the refreshment stand over there at the tent, you're welcome to go over there. We're so pleased that you've all joined us this evening. So 10 minutes, we'll be back to play again. Well, Coach Carfagno, for me, he was always motivating for us. I feel like he always found the words to bring our heads back up every single game. I feel like it was really tough during the, every season, but he always had the motivation to keep us going, keep us pushing. So I always remember that from him. He was always motivating. Coach Perfecto, muchas gracias por todo, por estar siempre a mi lado y más que nada porque siempre me decías que jugaba yo como un hombre de fútbol americano. Gracias. Coach Carfagno, you were the best, the best coach I ever played for and had the honor to play for. Uh, played from seasons 2005 to 08. Uh, you know, we'll be, we'll be highly missed and we all love you. Okay, well, we're here today to commemorate Carfagno. Thank you for being with us for the past four years. And the best memory that I will never forget is when you would call me Cindy knowing I was Leslie. But that will, I will always remember that about you. And thank you for always motivating us and encouraging us to do better and help us by learning our mistakes. Your memory will forever live on. Coach Carfagno, the last practice of the season, he told us to bring all shin guards. We didn't have them, so we ran. <laughs> Entrenador Perfecto, yo le quiero decir que muchas gracias por enseñarme las cosas que no sé y también decirme que nunca tengo que rendirme, así vayamos perdiendo 0-10. 
We just want to say that, you know, we thank you, Coach Carfagno. Thank you for all that you taught us and everything that you did for us, especially, you know, staying on top of us for what we did. So this is 8, 9, and 10, and we just want to say thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Coach Carfagno, we all came here today for you, and your memory will live on. Rest in peace. We are starting off the second half. Pink has two goals and white still has zero. White is driving its way up the field. Saved by the goalie on the pink team. <laughs> <laughs> it out to the Mitzi Katir is us now running after the ball, and the ball is. Rosemary of intercepted and the white team goalie has stopped the ball. Oh, goal, shoots. close goal, up oh, and misses. The goalie didn't save it, but the ball went out of bounds. Yes. Yes. White team goalie has the ball <laughs> and it's kicking it to Mitz, to Mitzi Gutierrez, Mitzi Gutierrez passes it to the other team from Sonia and the pink team passes up oh, and playing around to make her way around the defense. Bridget saves the ball from another goal from the pink team. <laughs> Sun's coming out. <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> oh, I mean, it's kind of exciting now. <laughs> Claudia has the ball. Kicking it to Emily. Emily misses the ball. And driving up the field. Oh, and Pink stopped it. And we're back to Sadie. Sandra. Allison now has the ball. Keeping it away. Sandra has the ball. Back and forth. <laughs> it really is back and forth. It's a back and forth game. 
That's how you no. know it's a big game. Yeah. I've said that before because if one team has more possession over the ball, then it's just a boring game because they're just going to keep scoring <laughs> and there's no point. <laughs> it's better to have two competitive teams. Yes. <laughs> kicks the ball in and now Claudia has a hold of the ball. Emily has the Emily still has the ball making her way. <laughs> ball is out and is getting Pink has a throw in. Yep. What can I say? Mackenzie finishes my sentences. <laughs> I mean, we're watching the same game. <laughs> <laughs> my first year. Uh, goalie year, stopped. Go mm, goalie has stopped the ball and is going to. Because originally I had no idea what to do. <laughs> it was my first year. And I had no idea what they were talking about. Me right now. <laughs> <laughs> I knew no terminology whatsoever. It was awful. Yeah. Well, it was out of bounds. And. Pretty sure it's six. Yeah, it's a kick from the six. Mm -hmm. From the goalie on the white team. And ball is out of bound. Don't and from the pink team. This time it's a throw on for white. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> 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 Jasmine has a ball, passes it. White and drives up the field. And oh. there's no one up there. Well, she had the ball, but she had one touch. It was too powerful. Oh, it's not out yet. Oh, that was a nice shot, but it was saved by the goalie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 oh, Mitty has messed the ball. Go pink. Oh, out. Tigatiris has the ball and trying to see who's open up on the field. Mm. Ball is back up. There are 20 minutes on the clock, and still white team zero and pink two. First 10 minutes of the second half, and no girl goals have been scored. <laughs> <laughs> We 
we just keep laughing. It's too funny of you. Okay, Jane is... There am I. <laughs> Was back in by the boat team. <laughs> oh, that was far when no one's up there. Mm -hmm. I thought it's out Emily kicks the ball, and Jane now from the white team has the ball. Is oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Mitzi stops the ball, and now yes, I mean 19 minutes on the clock. <laughs> I see it has the ball, kicked it to no one on that field. Oh, actually, wait, wait. There, oh. a goal from the from the pink team. Pink team. <laughs> yes, another goal from the pink team. So now the score is three to zero. Yeah. Okay, the ball is kicked to Claudia. Claudia kicks it back. To Claudia's running to kick. Yes. <laughs> Jasmine now has the ball. Uh, no, no. Claudia now has the ball. Back to Jasmine. Keep going back and forth to keep each other open. Jasmine has a ball, hearing it. Oh. Oh, that was a good save from the pink goalies. Team. Team. <laughs> Emily now has the ball from the pink team. Bringing it up. Now, white team. White is making several attempts to drive up the field and score, but pink's defense is very strong and keeps clearing the ball from their side of the field. The goalie on the pink team now has the ball and punts it to the center. Passes by Rosemary and is now on the pink team.
we have 15 minutes on the clock. Uh, score for the score is three to zero with pink with three and white with zero. Jane has the ball, passes it, and Claudia Morales now has the team. Uh, the ball. <laughs> Claudia Morales has the ball again, passes it back to another team on the white team. The ball is keep getting. Mm. Pink drives up the field, but no one was there to catch the ball. Because when no one's up there, people have to make that sprint. And if you communicate, it's easier because she would be there. Oh. Ooh. Claudia Marlis now has the ball, passes it to. Mitzi Gutierrez now has the ball, passing it. Well, trying to pass it back, it gets interfered by the pink team. Oh, Nerm, fine. Claudia Marlis has the ball once again and is passing it to. Up the field. <laughs> I'm fine. No. Mitzi gets here just running after the ball, but Jasmine has the ball, bunts it back, but it goes to the pink team. clears the ball. <laughs> <laughs> it's back and forth. <laughs> oh. She went to clear it, but a player on the white team was there to trap it and move it back up the field. There's a nice play by both girls, well, all the girls on the team, but from different teams, they're both playing good. With 11 minutes on the clock, yeah, White has to throw in 11 minutes on the clock. Jasmine has the ball and is running. Oh, saved by the pink team, from the pink team. The way team is trying to get a lot of goals in, but the pink team, the pink team's goalie is actually really good, and is stopping many of those plays from happening. Okay, Rossi is trying to make a goal in, and he stops by the white team. Mitchie Gutierrez now has the ball, passing it back to the goalie. Goalie catches the ball from...
pink team tied. Pink team tried to make another goal, but missed. Damn. Aside from the pink team has the ball, he's driving it, passes it on. Passes back to blue point. <coughs> Damn, I was good. Pink team is coming close to the goal. It is interfered with. We have eight minutes on the clock now. Close goal, but it was not there. Short. Sadie has the ball and is trying to pass it on. Sadie passes the ball to Emily, which is going. Oh! Jane has the ball, chasing up the ball, but gets stopped by the pink team. Uh, Mitty is fighting for the ball, but unfortunately he can't get it back. Sunny's kicked the ball, passing it to Sun. Well, he's waiting for the ball, oh, and it's hit. A nice save by the goalie on the white team. Ball is out on white and yes. by Ball is back out by white. I'm being thrown in. That was nicely done. <laughs> Maddie uh, has a ball, and now uh, Mitty has a ball past. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Jasmine still has a ball, is trying to find someone to pass it to, and interfered by Sandra. Wow. 
I know it's passing it back as they compete for the ball. Claudia Morales has the ball, is making it to the goalie, and the goalie from the pink team grabs the ball. There are five minutes left on the clock, and the pink team has three goals, and the white team still has zero. by the goalie from the pink team once again. Pink team passes it to Maddie. Is it? <laughs> it's pretty. <laughs> Emily kicks the ball, oh, hits. It's like a painting. Oh my god. <laughs> Where is my ball? Oh. Goalie from the pink team it has now has the ball and is kicking it in. And has gone to Claudia Morales. And has passed up. No one <laughs> up there. And he's running back to the goalie from the pink team. <laughs> and goalie kicks it once again. And Mitzi. <laughs> Maddie's not running up towards the ball and is interfered. Pink team and Jane. Oh, Jane has made a nice play by coming in between the pink and to the goalie. Nice play. Sandra is now kicking the ball from the corner. The corner kick in. Oh yeah, two minutes on the clock. Still three ahead by three points and White has zero points. Sayana has the ball, making her way, passing it on to another person on the pink team. Mitzi goes in to try to interfere. Maddie now has the ball, making her way towards the pink goalie. And is, say, catched by the white team's goalie. Kicks it to Claudia. Up, oh, miss kicks back. Oh. Kick by Claudia, but it's interfered by the pink team. Pink team passes, oh, passes right by Mitty Gutierrez, and now Maddie Plummer has it. Forty seconds on the clock. Oh, 
Claudia and the pink team are running after the ball, trying to stop each other. Mm. Twenty seconds on the clock, and ten seconds left on the clock. A good, nice play, nice play. Rocio is making a play, and oh, that was a close one. For and and that is it for today's in the NAS Narsten area high school soccer girls for in honor of Coach Carvero and Mom game. Thanks for joining in. Uh, the game ended with girls on the pink team of three and the girls on the white team of zero.